What's up, JD aliens? Look what the wind just blew in. It's a microphone set from Tonner. All right, we're gonna get into this, man. But first I wanna welcome the new guy, girl, who just showed up to the party. This is where we get down, man. So I hope you keep coming back. You might've showed up for this microphone, but you're gonna keep coming back for the party. So let's get into it. Let's do it. Now what we have here is a full microphone set from Tonner, which will include a pop filter, a shock mount, which you typically don't get a lot of times. I'm starting to see these pop up more and more often in these sets. These are usually extra. And then you get a windscreen for your mic. And what's in here? What is in here? This is a USB-A to USB-B cable right here to interface with your microphone and computer. Uh, what else we got? What else we got? Yes, we do have to mount this bad boy to our desk, which I'll just have to unravel that in a second. So it comes with the mount. And then you have the microphone itself. Let's see what it looks like. Oh yeah, it feels like quality, man. Toner actually does make pretty good stuff. I've used some of their handheld mics before and they were pretty darn good. Also, I've recently previewed uh, some of their, um, their podcast type of stuff, a USB microphone that was like a miniature one. It was actually really good as well. But this one, it just has an up and down. I'm assuming that's a, a gain or a volume maybe, but that's all the interfacing you get on this directional mic right here. So we're just gonna go ahead and see how this thing sounds after we open up the actual boom arm. So let's just unravel this just to get a quick feel of what it's like. And there we are, this is your boom arm and it is very lightweight and it's it seems to be constructed pretty well. So this is what we're gonna do here, man. I'm not gonna make this some long drawn out video with a whole bunch of tech specs and stuff. I know what you came to see, well, here, you came to hear if this is a good microphone or not. And what better way to hear that than for me to plug it up and then finish this video with the microphone engaged. So here we go. Let me get it set up and I'll be right back. The next day. All right, testing one, two. Okay, here we go. Let me take these off because I don't need them anymore. Hopefully this audio sounds good because uh, setting this up is very easy. It is truly a plug and play mic. It should be recognized immediately in your Windows PC. I don't know about Apple products, but in your Windows PC, it will recognize it immediately. But what you have to do is put on some headphones and then adjust your gain and do a couple of trials before you go live on whatever you're doing because you it doesn't have a headphone jack so you can't adjust your gain on the fly. Once you get it set, it should sound fine. Uh, I think this sounds fine. I'm not gonna do any editing in this video for the sound on this particular portion of the video. So what you're getting is what I'm putting out. Like this is the raw uncut version of it. But the microphone stand actually goes together very well. It's a very simple process. All you gotta do is look at it and you should be able to figure it out. It doesn't take a rocket scientist. I really do love the included shock mount. It keeps all the vibrations from you know interfering with your microphone because if I do this, you'll probably hear some feedback, but you're probably not gonna get much from me just doing a slight bump on the table. It does come with a pop filter, but I didn't feel like I needed it because I have this, um, this windscreen right here. So hopefully I'm not having too many plosives come out during my speech right now, but I do feel like it's a great microphone. And if you want to go ahead and purchase it, if this was something you were looking at and you just needed a review or a video or something, this is what it sounds like. But I got to go make some more videos, so I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. But until I see y'all again, be sure y'all keep being good to each other, and I'll see you when I see you. Oh, so you one of them cats that like to just run up in a place, take what you want, and then leave, huh? Man, you better hit that subscribe and notification button. That way you know when I'm over here opening up new stuff. And while you're down there, you might want to consider tapping that uh, join button and becoming a member because membership has its perks. See, that wasn't so bad. All right, man, I appreciate you. And I'll see you at the next one. Is that why you are here?